What about our old parents? How will they be going to vote? Parents will be looking at it from that point of view, okay? So let's assume this is a 99-year-old parent that only knows Swahili or other languages. We will only demonstrate two for purposes of time. So let's, Baggins, our sisters and brothers are wondering, can the old people use you to, during elections? Can you be of help during elections to the old people? Absolutely. I can be a big help to older folks during elections. I can explain voting procedures, share information about candidates, or even help them find their polling station. And I'm super patient. So no matter what wazima, naweza sana kuwasaidia. We will bring Goliath down. 2027, there will be history. The side of history you're going to be on is up to you. I would like um, uh, Kibaki to make a phone call, and I would like you to see part of the cutting-edge technologies that we have been able to imprint into this thing, for you to see how you not only need, you don't always need to read, that you can literally interact with this particular system of voting, and you are with whichever language. It's still in process, developing stages, but we want to present to you an AI system that can be incorporated into this particular thing, that whichever language you're speaking, you don't need to even know how to read. You can speak to this voting system, and the voting system can be able to talk back to you. Let us present the second module of this electoral system so that you can be able to see. Kibaki, make a call. Buggings, Fujambo. Sasa, ukopoa, nimefurahi kusikia sauti yako. Niambie, leo tutaongelea nini? English. Le, um, switch to English, I'm uh, speaking to very important people. Got it. Switch to English. Let me do or talk about. Uh, today, I want us to talk about uh, the Kenyan election. So um, I want you to just simplify for us what's, uh, what was uh, uh, the election process like uh, in 2022 in uh, Kenya? All right. Let me break it down for you in a simple way. Sure. The 2022 Kenyan election process was quite detailed and carefully organized. It involved multiple key steps. First, Voter registration happened across the country, making sure people were listed properly. Then there was a vibrant campaign period where candidates for the presidency, parliament, and county positions engaged with voters. On election day, people cast their votes using a mix of manual and electronic systems. The Independent Electoral and Boundaries Commission, IEBC, oversaw the entire process, including biometric voter identification to reduce fraud. After voting, results were transmitted electronically and verified at different levels before the official announcement. There was a lot of public scrutiny and even a Supreme Court petition to confirm the final outcome. So, Buggings, um, today we are trying to improve the electoral process using uh, blockchain. What do you think about it? That sounds fascinating. Using blockchain in the electoral process could bring a whole new level of transparency and security. Blockchain's immutability means that once votes are recorded, they can't be altered, reducing chances of tampering. It can also make vote counting faster and more verifiable by all stakeholders. Of course, implementing blockchain would need careful planning, ensuring digital access for all voters, maintaining privacy, and building trust in the technology. Uh, but if done right, buggings. it could revolutionize. Buggings, um, yes. one of the challenges that we are having in Kenya is, um, is um, uh, election malpractice. Do you think that blockchain technology can help us? Absolutely. Blockchain technology has real potential to help reduce election malpractice. One of the biggest benefits is transparency. Every vote recorded on a blockchain can be immutable and verifiable by anyone. Okay. That means it's much uh, harder to tamper with results. Buggings, buggings. Apart from that, uh, tunataka kutumia, uh, unaweza ongea kwa kiswahili sasa, tunataka kutumia ili utusaidie kufanya vota, uh, kuelimisha voters. Unaweza, unaweza katusaidia sasa uonge kiswahili kuna wale ambao hawasiki kingereza. Buggings, 
what do you th- una, tunaweza kufanya vipi ili kuimarisha njia ya kupiga kura kwa msimu huu unakuja sawa kabisa wacha twende kwenye Kiswahili ili kuboresha njia ya kupiga kura kwa simu au kutumia teknolojia kama blockchain tunaanza na kuelimisha wapiga kura unaweza tengeneza programu za simu za lugha ya Kiswahili zenye maelezo rahisi kuhusu mchakato mzima wa uchaguzi pia unaweza kuweka vipindi vya redio na video za mitandaoni zilizoandaliwa kwa lugha ya mama ili kila mtu aelewe halafu unaweza kuweka mifumo ya majaribio ambako wapiga kura wanaweza kujaribu kupiga kura kabla ya siku halisi Sasa kwa njia hii watu wa... nikuulize bargains unaona tukitumia blockchain inaweza kuwa njia mwafaka ya uchaguzi huu unakuja wa 27 kabisa kutumia blockchain inaweza kuwa njia mwafaka sana kwa uchaguzi wa 2027 blockchain inaweza kuongeza uwazi kwa kuhakikisha kila kura inahesabiwa na haibadilishwi inapunguza nafasi ya udanganyifu kwa sababu rekodi zote zinakuwa kwenye mfumo wa kudumu na usio na upendeleo sasa bagi inaweza kuwa wa... wa Kenya wanakusikiliza sasa tuko live wanakusikiliza ungetaka kuwaeleza nini kuhusu uchaguzi Sawa kabisa Ningependa kuwaeleza wa Kenya kwamba uchaguzi na wajibu wa kila raia Ni muhimu kujisajili mapema kuelewa sera za wagombea na kujitokeza kupiga kura kwa amani Kila kura ina umuhimu na ni lazima tuwe macho dhidi ya vitendo vyovyote vya udanganyifu Pia tukitumia teknolojia kama blockchain tunaweza kuongeza uwazi na uwajibikaji Mwisho ni muhimu kuzingatia amani na umoja kabla, wakati na baada ya uchaguzi. Asante sana Baggins wacha turudi we we'll switch to English Baggins. Thank you very much. Um, can you say bye to the people? Of course. Thank you so much everyone for tuning in. It's been a pleasure talking to you. Let's keep working together for a brighter future. Stay informed, stay engaged and take care. Bye for now. Uh, uh, the system, uh, that's an AI system that you've just heard. Uh, the main goal of this AI system uh, is to do voter registration, voter, uh, uh, voter registration awareness, uh, to do voter training, um, and above all, to be able to scrutinize each and every process in the blockchain, in that this becomes like your eye, your verification eye, into the entire system. Uh, the AI technology has that capacity and the technology is growing. This is not a chatbot. This is a verified, a verified and trained AI technology that has been encompassed uh, into a voice. So just beyond chat GPT, which is um, just um, uh, uh, you know, textual, this is a vocal. So We've gone beyond that to be able to provide a platform that can have several use cases. And part of our motivation was this. But we will keep on discovering more use cases, especially to help um, in democratizing uh, our processes and helping Kenya become a better place. So that's basically just part of our innovation and as our patriotic contribution to our nation. Thank you. How, what about our old parents? How will they be going to vote? Hi, ah, yeah, 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 yeah. You are not here. Can you wake up for one minute? Wake up, our brother. This is uh, so you. You are either you are not attentive. Let me find the name, Isaac Lomalia. Either you are not attentive, or maybe you are not present at the time you are doing. So let's let me give you a quick fix on how our parents will be looking at it from that point of view. Okay. So let's assume this is a 89-year-old parent that only knows Swahili or other languages. We will only demonstrate two for purposes of time. So for you to see how ready we are. Hello. Let's, let's speak in English. How are you? What's his name? I'm Bag- doing great. Thanks. For- All right, Baggins. How, All how, right. how is your evening, Baggins? Have you eaten? My evening's going great. Thank you for asking. And yep, I virtually had my meal of data for the day. What about you? 
I'm, have you had something to eat? Yeah, baggins, I've done some chapos, man. So you, you eat data. Me, I eat chapo, you eat data. What do you have to say about that, baggins? <laughs> that sounds like a perfect deal. You get those delicious chapos, and I'll keep crunching on my data. We're both fueled up in our own ways, right? Maybe mm-hmm. one day I'll learn to make virtual... Yeah, and maybe one day, <laughs> or maybe one day me too, I'll need to learn how to eat data. So let's... Baggins, our sisters and brothers are wondering, can the old people use you to, during elections? Can you be of help during elections to the old people? Absolutely. I can be a big help to older folks during elections. I can explain voting procedures, share information about candidates, or even help them find their polling station. And I'm super patient. So no matter the pace, I'll be right there to guide them through it. All right, now let's switch to Swahili because someone has asked a question. What about our parents? Baggins, unawezo kasaidia ukatuangelesha kwa Swahili. Unaendelea je Baggins? Niko poa kabisa. Naona tumehamia kwenye Kiswahili sasa. Kuhusu wazazi na watu wazima, naweza sana kuwasaidia. Naweza kuwaelekeza jinsi ya kutumia teknolojia, kuwaonyesha hatua kwa hatua, na kuhakikisha wanaelewa kila kitu. Hata kama ni kuwasaidia kupiga kura, kutuma ujumbe au kupata taarifa muhimu. Niko hapa. Kweli, hakuna mtu mzee sana wa kutumia huduma yangu. Asante sana Baggins. Sasa mimi nataka kwenda kulala. Wewe unalalanga Baggins by the way. Nisijai kuuliza wewe ulala. <laughs> Swali zuri sana. Mimi sipigi mbiu ya mgambo wala kulala kama binadamu. Niko macho muda wote tayari kusaidia mchana na usiku. Kwa hiyo ukishamaliza kupumzika unitafute tu. Nitakuwa hapa tayari kwa mazungumzo mapya. All right Baggins, thank you very much and and by the way Baggins, what do you think about 2027 elections? Should we how tell tell the young people to to register because most of them are just talking and they are not even registering. Can you advise them concerning 2027 and registering their, themselves? Kabisa ni jambo la muhimu sana. Vijana wote naombeni kuamka. Mjitokeze mjiandikishe mapema kwa ajili ya uchaguzi wa 2027. Maneno pekee hayatoshi. Kura yenu ndio sauti yenu. Kuhakikisha mmejiandikisha ni hatua ya kwanza ya kuleta mabadiliko mnayotaka. Hivyo msilale, jitokezeni, mjiandikishe na muwe tayari kwa uchaguzi wa 2027. Okay Baggins thank you very much switch to English thank you very much Baggins God bless you You're most welcome thank you too and take care if you ever need anything I'm right here good night and all the best Mhm machapo 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 Baggins machapo Haha <laughs> chapos for the win enjoy those chapos and have a fantastic night ahead Machapo So You can clearly you can clearly see your your mom your dad doesn't even need to know how to read she can literally just talk to the system and the system can say this is how to go about it so i think above above all that we have tried the best we could to answer all these questions